Hello everybody, welcome back to another AI tutorial. This is a quick one. I'm going to show you how to create full songs in Udio. That's right, I'm in the Udio beta as you can see up here at the top left. And in the middle here you'll see I have two songs that are 3 minutes and 17 seconds long. These are full songs and I created them from scratch. So you'll see here I started off with some 33 second snippets and then I just cooked it together and finally I cooked up a 3 minute 17 second song which is a full song. I'm going to show you how to do this. Let's go. All right, so the first step is to go to udio.com, of course, links in the description below, and then click on sign in. If you don't have an account, you can click on create. You can create an account or sign in. They're free to use. I'm going to use my Google account. So here we go. We are signed in. This is the front page. And now let's go ahead and create a song. Keep in mind that as it stands right now, you can only create content or songs in 32 second increments. So that's what we're going to do at the first part. All right, so let's start creating some music. So the first step here is to go up to the top into this prompt bar and then just type in what you want the song to be about. So for me, I got a song that's about an English bulldog that just sends it. He sends it every time. He gets gritty and knows how to gritty. <laughs> they write hashtags about this dog. He's that awesome. Okay, so I have a bulldog, as you can probably imagine, and I adore him just to the end of the world. So that is the type of thing you can do. Type in a prompt like that. Now the next thing you can do is I can go ahead and manually add in the type of tags that I want this song. So if I want it to be electronic, I don't know. I'm just having some fun here. Electronic rock. I don't know. Let's do some uh, synth pop. Why not? And then, you know, whatever you want it to be, whatever type of song you want it to be, do note here that they have suggested tags, and these tags are dynamic, so they sort of change as you add stuff in. So if I put in alternative rock, now you're going to notice that it's sort of changed the tags over to more rock type. So now I'm going to add in indie rock, and then now I want a male vocalist, and you can see just how much you could add into something like this. Keep in mind, though, you can delete any of this, and you can absolutely write in anything you specifically want. Now, once you've done that, do not click on create yet. There's three different options you have to consider. The first one I'll show you is on the left side. It's custom. If you've got your own lyrics, this is the one for you. Write your lyrics in here and then let it do its thing. If you do not want lyrics and you just want an instrumental, maybe you just want an, uh, you know, an electronic song or whatever, a pop song with no, <laughs> with no, with no vocals, whatever, go ahead and click instrumental. Most people though are going to select auto generated and this is the one that I'm going to use and this creates both lyrics and instrumental. So when you've got an idea of what you want and you've got your uh, modifiers and tags in there, click on create. It's going to cook two options for you. Here you see the top one, the bottom one. It's going pretty fast right now. So I'll come back and when this is done, I'm going to show you how to turn these into full songs. All right, so it's gone ahead and created two songs for us. And remember, this is still in beta, so this could change at any time. And it restricts them to 32 second snippets. So this is a lot like Lego blocks. We're going to be snapping together the song. I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's go ahead and listen to the first one here, Leap of Grit. <laughs> there we go. Let's go ahead and hit play, and then we'll look at the lyrics, and then we're going to look at uh, turning it into a full song. <laughs> Okay. All right, so the little bit that we heard there, this has got some of that rock, alternative rock, indie rock type thing going on there. Kind of songs you write if you, you know, you don't like your dad or whatever the heck it is these days. But anyways, there we go. We've got something. Now, if we want to make some quick changes, we can go ahead, click edit. And if I want to change this from Leap of Grit to Leap of Bully or something, whatever, I could just go ahead and change the name of the song just like that. Click on save. But there you go, guys. That is the first 32 seconds. Now, this is the important part. Let's look at extending this into a full song. All right. So the next step, it's pretty obvious, is you got to click on extend here. So when I click on extend, though, there's a few things you need to consider. And look at this. The, the biggest thing here is where you place the extension. Now, most AI generators or AI music generators I've used, they just sort of rethink it and regenerate. This doesn't really do that. This adds in sections. So, for example, right now we have some lyrics and we've got like a start of a song. But if I wanted to add an intro to this song, maybe I would click on add intro and then I would select the type of intro. My own music, my own lyrics, auto-generated or instrumental. If I wanted to have a musical instrumental beginning, let's say some sort of, you know, guitar-y, chord -y type thing going on there, I would select instrumental and then click on extend. 
At the same time, you'll see here that I can go ahead and add in more tags and do things there as well. So if I wanted to add in maybe a more alternative look, I can go ahead and start clicking on them and let's add in some electronic and we're actually adding in bits and pieces to the original idea so that we would create an, an intro. So in this case, we're going to add in a new intro. It's going to be instrumental. It's going to have the new uh, alternative type stuff going on here. I'm going to go ahead and click on extend and we're going to come back when it's done. I'll show you what we got. All right, welcome back. So you'll see here it's got two new creations. One of them is called Send It Bulldog. And the other one is full throttle pause. Now, remember this is still in beta, so this could change at any time. But if I go over to the left side and click on my creations, you'll see a few things here. One, the one that we were looking at, what were we playing? Leap of Bully or Boundless Charge? They've kind of been replaced by these two new options. One with a new name, full throttle pause, and one with send it bulldog. However, if you look here, it's a minute and six. So that means it's doubled in length, basically. And if I click on it, I'm assuming that they're going to have intro parts where the first 33 seconds is going to be an instrumental at the beginning. Let's click on the first one here and see what we got. All right, here we go. Yeah. So it has done exactly what it said it was going to do. However, it's not, it's a little weird here because it changed the name of the song. So the new combined entity has a new name. So I would go ahead and click on edit like I just did there. And then I would go ahead and go back to whatever I liked before. So Unleashed Fury or something like that. So I can go ahead and change the name at any time. So if the name changes, do not panic. And then I would go ahead and click on save. Now let's go ahead and extend it again. I'm gonna click on extend here. And now keep in mind that this is a minute and six seconds long, so it's two snippets. And now I can go ahead and start adding in bits and pieces. So if I wanted to add in a section after that minute and six seconds right here, I would go ahead and click on this one here, add section after. I would go and click on auto generated because this one I want lyrics to. And then what should happen is, is we're gonna have the intro, which was 33 seconds or so of just music with no lyrics. Then we're gonna have a second section with lyrics, which you've already seen, the Bulldog Stand stuff. And now we're gonna get a third section after the first two that also has lyrics. I'm gonna go click on extend, and then I'm gonna come back when this is done, show you what we got. All right, welcome back. So we've got two new ones here. We've got Grit and Grind, which is a great name, and we got Gritty Gritty Leap. Now look here, it's a minute and 38 seconds. So what we should have, if I click on this, is we're gonna have the intro, which is all musical, which is just an instrumental. Then we've got some lyrics for the second part, and the third part should have lyrics as well. So let's click on it and see what we got. Gritty, gritty leap. Okay, so let's see here. Oh, we've got new lyrics. Yes, this is working exactly like I had expected it to and wanted it to. So let's go ahead and listen to the beginning. It should be instrumental. All right, I dig it. After about 33, 34 seconds, it should be lyrics. Hold on stance. All right, so there we go. We've got our Sting type song here with our Sting lyrics. And then if we go to the last section, this should also be lyrics. And it looks like it is based on what I'm seeing here. So let's click on play and see what we got. Hmm. Life's a game, he plays for keeps with gritty paws. All right, he plays for keeps with gritty paws. All right, guys, this is just fantastic. So you see what we've done here? We've gone ahead and created a song. If we wanna make it over a minute and 38 seconds long, which I'm sure we do, we're going to click on extend. And in this case, I would add an outro. So I would click on that and then bang, we go ahead and start doing that. Also, if you need to, you can go ahead and change the little bits here. So if you wanna go ahead, he gets gritty, knows how to gritty electronic rock, but rock, synth pop, etc. But the end we want, maybe we don't want any of that. Let's get rid of all of that stuff. And let's make the end a little different. Let's make it, uh, what do you guys think? And you wanna do pop or rock or, let's do punk. All right, so I've got some punk, punk rock, punk pop. I don't even know what some of these things are. Uh, melodic hardcore, okay. And uh, punk new wave, and I've added that in. This is an extension to this song, but it's got a different style, different flavor. I'm gonna click on extend, I'll come back when it's done, 
and then I'll show you what we got. All right, welcome back. So we've gone ahead and added in another 33 second increment. And you'll see here now the song is two minutes and 11 seconds song. So this is on the short end of a full song. You'd probably want to add in another increment or two. Also, they've gone ahead and renamed them again, so so be it. Let's go ahead and click on Bulldog Bravado. Why not? Let's go ahead and listen to this. And keep in mind that we've been adding in uh, increments step by step. So let's see what we got here. Okay. That is good. Now, what did we get at the end? Let's go right to the end. See what we got here. Said he won't be beat. Okay, so we got what we wanted. We got another lyric, basically, or another verse, in a sense, at the end here added in. So basically, by doing these steps, we've gone ahead and created a full song. We did it step by step. We snapped it together. That's how you do it with Udio. Leave a comment below and let me know what you think, guys. Thanks for watching. A lot more stuff coming up.